works with the Turkish-based Anadolu Agency covering the Pentagon here in Washington, and he joins us in the studio. Kasim, great to have you with us. Talk to us a little bit more about what this operation looks like. How detailed is it? How involved is it? First of all, thank you very much for having me here. Uh, this is one of the most comprehensive operations that Turkish armed forces uh, takes in northern Iraq. Uh, we have several operations in the past on northern Iraq, and this one, of course, one of the, those comprehensive operations. Uh, based on um, Turkey has been, of course, launching day-to-day -day airstrikes into the, uh, the these mountainous areas, but this one. Uh, we have fighter jets involved, it's a combined operation. We have fighter jets involved, we have unarmed, unmanned uh, capability, we have land forces, and we have artillery at the same time, and we have a strong, of course, ISR support. So it's a, it's a, a combined joint operation w within the whole Turkish armed forces across Turkish armed forces. Based on the airstrikes, um, Turkey also, besides those airstrikes, Turkey also conducted today an air assault into those this mountainous area that's that's important to note because you have it's a very tough uh, place and then it's a hostile area and then you are landing uh, commandos with helicopters into that area that's a that's such a you know um, it shows the comprehensivity it shows the extensiveness of the operation that we have we, we are seeing so cousin what's the mission here and how does this fit into turkey's overall defense strategy when it comes to eliminating the pkk yeah. in iraq and in syria from from its yeah. border so um it's important to note uh, that hakurk is a is a it's is a strategic location for pkk if you check the map, you will see that Kandil is just south to the Hakurk, and the rest, Hakurk is just immediate south of Turkish border, and the rest of the camps laid across the Turkish borders goes from east from uh, Hakurk to west and into northern Syria. So you have Avashin, you have Metina, you have Zab, you have Sinjar, and then from there you have Karachok, and then you have northern Syria. Hakurk is one of the biggest camp uh, following Kandil because Kandil is the headquarter and then Hakurk is one of the biggest camp that PKK mass fighters and sources there. So uh, taking out ha Hakurk from the battlefield and then you know closing this camp, destroying this camp will allow Turkey to close the supply line from other camps into Kandil and at the same time from Kandil to into Turkey as well as into northern Syria. So it's a, it's a strategic point that Turkey should take uh, in terms of cutting the supply lines of Kandil and of course cutting the, line, the communication between disconnect Kandil from the rest of the PKK uh, camps laid into uh, northern Iraq and northern Syria. All right, Qasem Aledi, appreciate you breaking that down for us. Thank you so much for Thank that. You.